Hello Hacktubers and welcome back to my channel. I got a new video for you. Let's begin. Okay, what is this? It's a great tool. It's a stainless steel tool. You can see letters. Yep, that is a alphabet. And we have from zero up to nine numbers. And you guess. Alphabet letter number leather stamping tool set. You can choose 3 millimeters or 6 millimeter steel punch metal leather punching punching tools DIY. Whoa. I have choose one the 6 millimeters and this cost me almost seven dollars free shipping and 25 days to arrive to me from aliexpress alphabet punching tool stainless steel okay the first thing that i'm gonna test it This is the handle. I'm gonna test it's this a stainless steel or cheap metal. This is a magnet. Okay. This battery is metal. Look, but the steel stainless steel is okay. Let's try it on the letters. Nope. This is good. So here it is the handle. And here it goes the any letter you choose or number. I'm gonna choose number three. And it looks like this and just press it and it's ready for punching here by the way I forgot to mention there are 36 pieces letters and numbers alphabet plus numbers for around seven dollars this is cool Did you see that? All oh, jump. Oh my Okay, this tool is cool, you can punch letters and numbers on metal pieces like this, this is aluminium, this is wood, and I like it, okay. Today video 
is about this product. It's a digital LED voltmeter ampermeter regulator or step down model and it's looking very nice it, and these are the specifications input voltage from 5 volts up to 36 volts regulated output voltage from 1.25 volts up to 36 volts maximum current is 8 amperes but it's not recommended 5 amperes 5 amperes is the max Okay, here it is. And here it is a close up. Of the whole model this is the main knob for adjusting the voltage two LED displays with three digits it's marked with voltage and amps and behind the board the all microchips we have voltage in, voltage out these are the MOSFETs with heatsink for cooling and it looks like a great model and cheap and maybe this is the cheapest adjustable digital power supply $10 with all components okay now I'm gonna power up and I'm gonna bring 19 volts and using the old laptop adapter that give 19 volts voltage in right here The black and the red wire is voltage in and from other side I will connect an ordinary light bulb just for experiment and to see the voltage just to bring 19 volts You can see that it's giving 1.2 volts and the bulb it's not turned on 1.635578 volts Whoa. the negative was touching the positive for a moment of I will blow up the model. Almost new. Okay. Now I'm going to increase the voltage. The 
there is a protective circuit look it's not giving the power this is the maximum Ten volts and four hundred milliampers. This is showing the, the voltage and this is the the amperes. Seven point eight volts three hundred and fifty milliampers. Okay. And right now I'm testing how precise is this digital power supply and most cheapest ten dollars with my digital multimeter fluke 1.2 volts I'm gonna increase to 9.2 volts showing here 9 volts okay let's choose 15.3 15 volts it's a little bit weird, but it's working fine. 3.2 volts, 3.1. Okay. 8 by 4. 6.9, 6.8. Okay. It's working fine. Very portable and compact power supply model. It's worth ten dollars, believe me. Just you need a one cool box where you can place it the model and place the power adapter 19 volts that you need. You can use from old laptop, it's fine. They give around 60 watt watts. I can't believe it ten dollars. If I wanted to make this probably I will spend a couple of days and oh my god this is cool okay as you can see on the photos it's a LCD USB voltmeter ampermeter battery charge voltage current meter multimeter cable measurement tester as it says on the title and how it, how much cost it's around twenty dollars depends on which model you get it I get UM24 Here it is It comes in nice metal case package You can scan the and download the, the instructions code with this code Let's power up. A very cool LCD design in color. It shows the voltage, the amps, 999 ohms of resistance. It can measure milliwatts, watts, it have a couple of groups also have inside built-in uh, thermometer it shows the, the temperature 16 degrees right now 
milliampers, milliwatts. And it have a bar graph. And ampere meter bar graph for showing the the voltage and the amperes. I'm gonna attach this LED light bulb and it says that it's consume 168 milliampers three milliwatt per hour this spending and this is the bar graph for the voltage steady 5 volts the amps around 200 milliampers and when I turn it off will drop at 0 amps it's a LCD display as I said with multi colors and this thing is awesome beside the the USB for powering you can power up by micro USB connector very cool de device for around twenty dollars on Aliexpress you can find a lot of test pencils with uh, LCD screen and I get it the most cheapest two dollars it can detect DC or AC voltage with range of from 12 up to 250 volts directly or indirectly two dollars for this voltage detector 12 volt battery let's measure you need to press on this button and it shows 12 volts okay non-contact measure here it is the sign it's a multi-purpose tool electric tool can measure AC voltage you can see that all the numbers are displayed up to 220 volts and have small light bulb for indicating that this is a live wire For $2.50 you can get desktop PC power ATX transfer board power adapter supply model new board really it's a good design of board for making homemade power supply out of ATX power box for the computers here comes the, the main jack from the ATX box it has the switch power off or on four fuses and one, two, three, four, four outputs plus 12 volts 
plus 5 volts plus 3.3 volts and negative 12 volts it's a nice board and that I like it for sure I will make a great project with this okay for ten dollars I get star moon night light lamp battery operated USB operated here it is battery operated with three AA batteries or you can use this short USB cable it have three buttons A, B, C probably for choosing the light effect let's plug in working why it's not working is there a secret switch let's try it with batteries With the cable it's not working but with the batteries working great blue RGB okay nice okay wow it's working with batteries but with the cable no This is great and I like it a lot. You can choose whatever color you want. Green, blue, RGB or just I need to fix this and I will do that's up was all for today video thank you for watching please share like and subscribe to my channel